What's up, GQ? My name is Richard Mendoza, owner of Filthy Rich Barbershop here in New York City. I own two barbershops, one in Brooklyn and one in Queens. I've been a barber for over 23 years, and all I do is like to make people look good. Today, we're gonna recreate Robert Pattinson's haircut on Michael. Let's bring our client, Michael. How's it going, Rich? What's up, man? Good to see you. Yes, thanks for doing this. Damn, thank you for coming. I'm excited. I'm excited too. You're about to have an awesome makeover right now. I'm looking forward to it. Robert Pattinson is one of my favorite actors. Let's look at Robert's hair evolution. In 2005, I could see that he has a nice little coastal short top and a little messy style front. Kind of wavy, kind of long. 2008, his hair has got even a little bit longer and messy, but style with some products I could tell. 2010, he got a little shorter on the sides, kind of a clean face like yours. And 2012, he has a slick back. That's actually a nice cut too. Just a little pomade, his beard is a little longer. Oh, he went really short on the side. He, wow. got, he got a real like military undercut style haircut. That's cool, it's very European. Mm, very. This is more of like a James Dean style, you know, longer sideburns. 2015 was a good year for Robert. Oh, oh wow. 2016, he, went, he cut it all. He cut it all. He's like, <laughs> I got tired of hair. 2017, he pushing it forward, give it a little bit of a fringe look. And then, wow, his hair grew fast. <laughs> After yeah. two years later, in 2019, it's now slicking back. It's coming back where he was in 2008. And then 2022, that's a good cut. Nice little yeah. comb over, nice and neat, it's clean. I guess if for Batman, he had to shave his face so you get that look. And then 2022 spring, that's a cut. Real messy on the top, a little short on the sides, not too short, it's more softened. I love this look. Yeah, I do too. Let's so, do it. Let's do it, you ready? Yeah. So I'm gonna blow dry your hair, straighten out your hair. I'm gonna man bun it, and then I'm gonna give a horseshoe guideline for myself so I can lay your hair flat. I'm gonna add the clippers, and then I'm gonna soften texture it with a scissor to make it look like it's not barber style, more of a styling look. I'm gonna cut from the top, but make sure I give a longer length, and I'm gonna work myself lower. We're gonna give you a nice little shave, and you're gonna look like Robert. <laughs> And then after that, add a little products and we're gonna shift from the left side and the right side of the hairstyle so he knows how to work with his hair after we're done with this. You ready? Let's do it. Yeah. All right. This is crazy. When's the last time you blow dry your hair? I don't think you ever blow dry your hair. I don't ever blow dry You're more hair. like, I wake up and this is my hair. And I'm out the door, yeah. yeah. <laughs> But we're gonna give you a look where you could style during the day, style during the night, and just give you this nice short haircut vibe. Now I just straighten out your hair a little bit, and I'm gonna do a horseshoe part, and I'm gonna split it to give me a guideline so I can lay it flat. It's rare for me to get a haircut, and I went recently, but I didn't know how to explain the style that I wanted. I wanted this, you know, Robert Pattinson look where it's like short on the sides, and you kind of have it longer up top and be able to go e either way. I always tell my clients is, I like to see a reference of pictures, and what we just saw earlier it was actually the perfect example for me to give you the right guideline of the haircut you want. I <laughs> will make the magic. So right now I'm gonna take the clipper four. I'm just gonna run it up. When's the last time you had a clipper on the side of your head? It's been four years. <laughs> <laughs> so I usually run the clipper just to take the bulk out. So then after I take the bulk out, I use the scissors to lighten up and soften the sides. This is a horseshoe guy, like it's more like I'm giving him an undercut and then I'm gonna start blending it through and mix it around with his hair. All right, we take down the sides with the clip four, give you a nice little balance. After that, now I'm gonna trim the top. I'm gonna leave the front longer and the back a little shorter. Oh, your hair is really curly and it's yeah. Yeah, really thick hair. I'm always playing with a different hairstyle, yeah. It's been long in the past. I've been doing it shorter, but trying to keep the curls. So I'm giving myself a guideline for the back. When I cut hair, I make sure like everything's like straight box up, and then I start uh, horizontaling the sides. I don't want the back to match where it's gonna look like one shape all around. I wanna give the front more of like a pomp, but also when you put products, we could style it with it. I'm leaving a little bit more hair on the side a little longer, so it matches from your chin to your top of your head. I don't want to cut too in, that might give you like a military look. How do you recommend people choose their haircut? 
Anybody could pull off any haircut. You're the person who carries your look. You're giving yourself a, an image. So if you're out acting or singing, you're trendsetting, you know, like, oh, I want to look like you because you have the coolest hairstyles. That's why you got to reach the barber. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so now I'm going to go to your sides and soften the haircut because I did a buzz cut. So right now I'm taking my trimmer and just cleaning around his ears. I also like to just blend this off since we're gonna give you a, a quick shave to clean up your face. So how to take care of your haircut is like, if you feel like it's too long, that's the time to go get a haircut. This haircut style is more like, I see you once a month. Oh, I love that. I noticed you, you cut your back. You did this yourself? I did, yeah. Mm. I, so um, I <laughs> I'm gonna just uh, blend it because it's, Kind of messy. All right, so let's shave your face. And then after that, we add the products. I'm gonna blow dry your hair again. Your natural curl's coming out. So we're just gonna try to straighten it out with the blow dryer. I blow with hot air, so it helps you direct the hair where I want it to go. And then when I add cold air, it locks the hair. Just me locking the hair with cold air, it's now giving that Robin haircut style look. You can actually see it. Right now there's no products to make it more fine and having a good shape. So right now I'm using the Hansa Fuku Claymation. Helps me hold down the front. And you know, I can add a little texture powder. Also, if you want to do pomade, you can slick the back. Those are the three styles that you can use with the three products. How to put products on your hair is you make sure it's all over your hand. So all the products in the back and then the leftovers in the front. It's like you're ready to go out. So the trick is you get your front of your hair and just twist it and just let it fall wherever it wants to take you. You know, styling is, is hard, so always open your fingers. Go with the flow. You can see the cut is nicely textured and put together. Yeah. All right, you ready to see it? Let's do it. All right, let's go. Woo! Oh my gosh! <laughs> this looks amazing! Thank you so yeah, much. So good. Yo, I love it. The tips are so cool and they like twist. So yeah. quick maintenance, wash your hair every other day. You want the true oils to come out of your skin and, and put some volume to your hair. If there's a powder for the morning and I put in claymation so it's more wax. And then if you want to like style at night, you can add pomade and slick it back. So you have like those three choices. See me every once a month okay. for that <laughs> for a nice little cleanup on the sides. And I say your top is every two months you get you get a nice trim. I got you a Gillette lab to help you clean your face. Thank here's you. A here's a shaver and the cream and get you nice and smooth. Appreciate it. Yo, I appreciate Thank you. Thank you, Rich. Thank you. That was Robert's short, spiky haircut. Thank you for having me. Peace.